How would the later matchup play out? Coldwater and Van Wert scoreless in the fourth thanks to good pitching. Brant Henry sets down Aaron Hallermert swinging to end the inning. Still has not allowed a hit to this point. Top of the fifth. Derek Toby pitching a gem as well, but two outs, nobody on. Mason Carr finds the gap in left center. It falls in. Carr is in the second with a double. That brings up Justice Tussing, the top of the order, and he delivers base hit in the left field. Carr waved around third. Play at the plate. There is none. He slides in safely. Cougars break through first on the RBI single, and they lead it one to nothing. Bottom of the fifth. One out. Craig Shane here drives one deep to left. He had two homers in a game earlier this season. This one stays in the yard, but it's good for a double. That's the first hit of the game for the Cavs. Tying run is in scoring position. Later, runners on first and third, two down. PD Post hits it well out to left, hangs in the air long enough for Mason Carr to move over and grab it. Mason had some nice diving grabs earlier in the game as well. That play keeps the Van Wert lead intact. Derek Toby doing his part to keep it a one-run game in the top of the six. Let's go to the bottom of the six. Henry still feeling it. Malave Benninger goes down swinging. Bottom of the seventh now, last licks for the defending state champs. Aaron Hollermert pulls a single into left field to start off the inning. Tying run is on base. Derek Toby bunts Hollermert up to second on the sacrifice. So they got him on, they got him over. Now they need to get him in. Craig Shane here back at the dish. Huge strikeout for Henry, second out of the inning. Hollermert still on second. It all comes down to Brandon Kunk. He looks at strike three. Van Wert beats Coldwater one to nothing. The RBI by Tussing was the difference. Tremendous pitching performance by the lefty Brant Henry, and it sends the Cougars to the district finals. We uh, had a good game plan in place. My kids executed uh, offensively, defensively. Uh, obviously, I had to give Brant Henry a lot of credit on the mound. He threw a heck of a game. We've been talking about this since day one of the tournament. It's huge. I mean, everybody has trust in each other. It's a great team win. Best feeling in the world. Last four or five games, he's been lights out, throwing, ball, throwing BBs and locating uh, three pitches, fast curve change, for, uh, throwing them off for strikes. He's doing a great job. It's the energy game. We have the energy in the dugout and the trust out in the field. We're a great defensive team. It comes down to it. Make the simple plays and trust in your guys. Just everything we could possibly do right, we did it today. So taking a look at the Elida region, OG and Van Wert will meet Saturday at 2 p.m. At ONU, meanwhile, Edison 10-5 winners over Woodmere and Huron 8-5 victory over Margaret.